This lecture is a guide for concrete defects and deterioration. These are some defects listed over here. Honeycombing. Segregation. Bleeding. Leaching. Sulfate or acid attack. And corrosion of reinforcement steel. Honeycombing is hollow space and cavities left on surface or inside of the concrete mass. The surface is coarse and stony, which would be result of insufficient fine material in the mix. Leakage of mortar fraction from the concrete at construction or from work joints. Improper vibration during concrete and use of very stiff concrete. The damages can be occur like small, shallow areas cosmetically unappealing. Deeper areas leads to reduction in the protection to the reinforcement, hence possibly durability problems in the future. The possible solution is to apply grouting chemical, or isolate the affected area by removing layers of honeycombing until suitable concrete is exposed. Segregation is the separation of the constituent materials of concrete resulting in non-uniform mix. For instance, separation of coarse aggregates from cement paste which is generally caused by high water cement ratio in concrete, poor gradation, due to bad mix design, improper mixing. The most common reason is to place concrete from height especially for underground foundations. The possible solution is to alter sand and water content, using fine sand, and proper handling during transportation and placing. It may result in honeycombing which will reduce strength and durability of concrete member. Bleeding occurs when water in the concrete tends to rise to the surface of freshly placed material. Predominantly observed in a highly wet mix, badly proportioned fine aggregates, and insufficiently mixed concrete, makes top surface porous, dusty, and weak. To avoid bleeding ensure removal of water through dewatering or evaporation before finishing. Leaching occurs when water flows through cracks, dissolving the minerals, CaOH, twice, contained in the concrete mix. Produces a sandy appearance on concrete surfaces and causes erosion of internal concrete. It can be controlled by, reducing permeability. Converting the soluble calcium hydroxide into insoluble calcium silicate hydrate CSH. Sulfate or acid attacks can possible if high concentrated sulfates, sulfuric, hydrochloric, and nitric acids are found in groundwater and soil. Sulfates causes chemical changes to cement, disintegrating concrete in only a few years. Resistance can be improved by converting calcium hydroxide to the more chemically stable calcium silicate hydrate CSH. Corrosion leads to internal stresses that causes the formation of cracks and disrupt the concrete structure. Ensure, rebars have been properly installed, for example, not located too close to the concrete surface in contact with the air. Solution can be proper covers on bottom and sides, 